And Egbert, everything he does, whether it's business or his personal life, uh, there's this undergirding of the value of social justice. It's very rare that you meet someone who has integrity, compassion, and intelligence all in one package, focused on something that they care passionately about. When I look at the urban landscape, some of the challenges I see have a lot to do with the quality of life available in communities in cities. And so we started out as, an, as a community development organization, which the, the important word there is community. Our vision came to life first and foremost in the revitalization of what was at the time Techwood Homes. On that 60-acre site, we created Centennial Place and created a community that answered one fundamental question. What would it take or what would the community need to look like and be like for us to want to live there? It's about creating a place where each human being is valued and is expected to live up to very high standards. It's not easily remembered or realized that this site had the highest crime rate in the entire city of Atlanta when we were starting this. It became the first ever in the country national model for integrating school reform with mixed income housing and et cetera, et cetera. And we woke up the next day and we were national experts. Auburn Point is a magnificent community. It is intergenerational. So intentionally, there were several phases developed for persons who are older. It is important that we provide for our seniors in their late years the type of quality of life experience that they deserve, that they earned. When he talks about his mom and his dad who have gone on to glory, you know, he talks about them with such love and reverence. And so that is so much of who he is as a human being. I'm every bit my father's child up and down. I don't have champagne taste. I'm as simple as they come. At the end of the day, I'm not trying to impress anybody. I'm actually, I, that's probably a lie. I'm probably trying to impress my mother and my father. Egbert's legacy is being a person that used his business skills and his values to offer a different model to addressing some of the inequities uh, in our society. And the thing about the successes when you do that is uh, the, the successes are so powerful, but they're unseen because they're not just a building.